Before start this video, please subscribe my channel and click on bell icon. Thanks. Stellantis unveiled its all-new STLA medium platform, designed for all-electric vehicles, passenger cars, crossovers, and SUVs, in C and D segments. It's the first out of four new all-electric platforms, small-slash-medium-slash-large-slash-frame, which were announced two years ago, in July 2021 at the Stellantis EV Day 2021 presentation. The company explains that the STLA medium is designed to electrify the heart of the global car market, as C and D segments account for nearly half of the total vehicles sold globally, 35 million out of 78, 5 million. In the case of Stellantis, the group's brands offer 26 vehicle nameplates in those segments, currently using a variety of platforms. Full electrification of those models with the use of STLA medium platform could potentially result in up to 2 million BEVs annually, which would be produced at several plants across the world, starting in Europe this year. Stellantis also says that the new platform is designed to meet customer expectations on what matters most to them, best-in-class range of more than 700 kilometers, 435 miles charging time performance, efficiency, affordability, driving pleasure. Let's now move to the technical potential of the platform. Stellantis STLA Medium Platform The Stellantis STLA Medium Platform will be used for a double-digit number of models from various brands. General targets, segments, C and D segments body type, passenger cars, crossovers, and SUVs brands, multiple brands potential production, up to 2 million units annually wheelbase, 2, 700 to 2, 900 millimeters overall length, 4, 3 to 4. 9 meters ground clearance, more than 220 millimeters to ensure off-road kapabi. There will be two main battery options, up to 98 kilowatt hours, kilowatt hour, of usable battery capacity, standard pack, more than 310 miles, 500 kilometers, WLTP performance pack, more than 435 miles, 700 kilometers, WLTP up to 98 kilowatt hours, kilowatt hour, of usable battery capacity as we understand, the smaller battery will be. The STLA Medium Platform's battery system will rely on a 400-volt electric architecture, Stellantis uses 800V systems only in some of its BEVs, based on the STLA Large and STLA Frame. Stellantis STLA Medium Platform According to the company, the energy efficiency of the new platform is expected to be best in class, at less than 14 kilowatt hours per 62 miles, 100 kilometers, or 225 wh slash mile, 140 wh slash km. The numbers are related to the WLTP test cycle, as we understand. Energy consumption less than 14 kilowatt hours per 62 miles, 100 kilometers, or 225 wh slash mile, 140 wh slash km, very interesting is its fast charging capability, which according to the company will allow recharging the battery from 20 to 80 percent of state of charge, SOC, in 27 minutes. It's not as fast as in the case of some of the fastest charging mainstream models, but not the slowest either. Stellantis revealed also that the charging rate will be 2. 4 kilowatt hours per minute. If we recalculate it to power, it should be 144 kilowatts, potentially, that's the average rather than the peak. Nothing special, but probably acceptable for average mainstream models. Fast charging. 20 to 80 SOC in 27 minutes rate, 2, 4 kilowatt hours per minute, or some 144 kilowatts, 64, 
1.8 kilowatt hours assuming flat rate over 27 minutes, according to Stellantis. The STLA medium platform will deliver best-in-class battery packaging cost that also enhances production volumes. To keep things simple, the perimeter dimensions of the battery pack are constant, regardless of the battery version, with common tray and cooling designs. Stellantis engineering and manufacturing experts focused on making installation of the modular, high-energy density single-layer battery pack at the assembly plant as efficient as possible, maximizing space inside the vehicle and improving ride and handling with a low center of gravity. Platform components, such as the cabin heating slash cooling system, steering, braking assist and propulsion are designed to minimize energy consumption. Those efforts combine with extensive use of lightweight and rigid materials to optimize vehicle range and deliver exemplary ride and handling performance. Future proof All of the new Stellantis platforms are promised to be engineered to be future proof, including modularity and flexibility, wheelbase, width, overhang, ride height, and suspension design. The company's plan is to adapt and improve the capabilities and performance of vehicles over the years with the implementation of the STLA Brain Architecture, STLA Smart Cockpit and STLA AutoDrive platforms, enabling over-the-air updates to software and enhanced hardware. The company is ready to a. Carlos Tavares, Stellantis CEO said, what we see today is the product of just over two years of no-compromise innovation to deliver clean, safe and affordable mobility, supported by our 30 billion euro investment in electrification and software through 2025. The STLA Medium platform demonstrates the power of the global Stellantis technical community, delivering products that are hyper-focused on our customers and rewriting long-held assumptions of transportation as we drive for carbon net zero by 2038. 100% electric lineup in Europe by 2030 Stellantis. In the United States, the BEV sales mix among passenger cars and light-duty trucks will be 50% at that point. Thanks for watching. Credits to Incidives.com Please like my video and subscribe EVpedia for more electronic vehicle news and updates.